What is up, YouTube? Just want to take a minute to say uh, thank you for checking out my video. Uh, make sure you comment and tell me what song you want me to react to next. Like, subscribe, share, dislike. Uh, tell me my head's too shiny. You think I'm stupid. Whatever. You think I should be nice to the cat, even though she's spoiled. Um, yeah, and, and the new this year, um, I have a P Patreon set up. Um, I don't know that if you become a Patreon, I'll do anything special for that. Uh, I, I personally hate paywall content. Um, I know one of, one of the podcasts I list too. They read the list of Patreon, so maybe once or twice a month, I'll read the Patreon list and everybody who's become a Patreon. Um, should be fun. All right, guys. I will get to that video here shortly. Have a good one. What is up, YouTube? It's your friendly neighborhood running bald man back again for another video. And today is 4th of July. Uh, so this is obviously recorded uh, a little bit early, about a week or so early. Um, but I did just get a pleasant email from YouTube. I have been accepted into the YouTube Partner Program. Uh, I'm not exactly sure what that means. I think I can get a little, I don't know, um, have members of the channel, whatever, for a fee. And uh, you can get special emojis or whatever to drop in the comments. Um, but more on that as I get more acclimated and dig into it and see what that is. But today is story time. And we're going back to put Tony's nuts in your mouth. <laughs> uh, this again is from Reach Around Publishing. Um, I'm not too thrilled about the finding the reach arounds that I've been trying to do with these. So I think I'm just going to do a reading uh, of this again, uh, like I originally did. Uh, but yeah, let's get into it. Put Tony's nuts in your mouth. It kind of feels appropriate for a 4th of July recording anyway. Um, but yeah. So put Tony's Nuts in Your Mouth, written by Bimsi uh, Tayanita, illustrated by Sam Gun Gain, Bangladesh, and is created by Matt Williams, aka Tripod. Yeah, that's that's got to be an innuendo about something, but. Yeah, this so we're still on season one, and this is book four. Put Tony's nuts in your mouth. Tony has big nuts and small nuts. Let me take a minute and move this over here so I can see. There. He has pecans, pecans, walnuts and walnuts. Nuts without or with a shell. There's no nut that Tony does not sell. I get fancy, smooth, tasty, and fine nuts. Tony sells his nuts all day. He always has a line. I was looking for a little gigantic, sweet, mmm, fancy, or prime nuts. Ah, it's Spank the Monkey. Some say Tony's nuts smell great. Some say they taste divine. Eat me. They drive or walk or ride the bus. They come from north and south. 
to take those hot and salty nuts and put them in their mouths. <laughs> Tony dips his chocolate nuts until they are just right. He knows your mom will take them home and suck them tonight and suck on them tonight. <laughs> Great place for your, your mom joke. BJ looks at Tony's nuts and tries hard not to stare. As Stefan grabs at his nut sack and finds a big old pear. BJ plays with Tony Nuts in the closet at his house. Grandpa says he should just come on, come out, as he pops one in his mouth. Oh, there's a picture of come swing with us. Grandpa likes to go in there and take his camera with him. He loves to look at photographs when Tony's nuts are in them. <laughs> Sounds like a uh, OnlyFans concept. He swears it isn't weird or queer. He says it's not a crime. Grandpa licks the salt right off. Of Tony's nuts sometimes. <laughs> oh. The girls too like Tony's nuts. Of this there is no doubt. Every girl around this town has put them in her mouth. Yeah, I wish my name was Tony. <laughs> on the way to school today, riding on the bus, the Johnson twins were in the back sharing Tony's nuts. I like her. She's got a bag of nuts in her hand and smoking a cigarette. I wonder what she just did. Back and forth they open up, hoping that they don't get those big and tasty nuts stuck down their throat. <laughs> they need a little bit more practice then, don't they? <laughs> Even Miss Bulldyke the softball coach and her special friend will have a go at Tony's nuts every now and then. Ha! Huh. She got Lucy lick a lot of puss on her shirt. <laughs> there really is no argument. Mount Rushmore ought to be a monument of Tony's nuts. For all the world to see. And that is the end. If you haven't done it, done it yet, you're misreading out. Grab a sack of Tony's nuts and put them in your mouth. And that is the end of Put Tony's Nuts in Your Mouth. <laughs> yeah, this, this is probably one of my favorite ones. I mean, just the title alone is enough to get you rolling. Um, but yeah, that'll do it for Put Tony's Nuts in Your Mouth. 
Uh, so with today being 4th of July, make sure you grab a sack of Tony's Nuts and munch on them all day long. The uh, 4th of July um, hot dog eating contest is about to kick off here in about a half hour or so. So I'm going to be watching that um, as those guys take that big old dog and bone and uh, chow it down, shove it in the mouth. I wonder if there's a uh, contest for or a nut eating contest. Uh, I'm sure there is. There's an eating contest for everything. Um, and shout out to Illegal Ham to the Face, a Cleveland sports podcast. A friend of mine from high school had it, Jared Fatty Bates. And recently, about a month ago now, probably about the time that this this video releases, uh, he had, um, wow, well, I can't remember what his name is now. Um, I feel bad. Uh, but it, it, he is the fourth ranked eater in the world. Not Jared, but uh, the guy they had on as a guest. Uh, so he, he's been on there before. It's it's a good time. He's fun. Uh, you know. So check it out. Illegal Ham to the Face. And I'll try and put the link to the uh, page down this in the uh, description of this. They stream their podcast live uh, every Tuesday at 7 p.m. Eastern Time uh, on YouTube, Facebook, basically just about everything you think of. And I'm sure they're on all the podcast streaming services as well. So check them out. Um, and I'm I'm usually in the comments making fun of him or making fun of something, making some wisecrack joke too. So uh, that'll do it for today, you guys. You'll have a good day. And I'll see you next time.